starting this video off in my redstone testing world. I need blackstone for the Eye of Sauron. I'm trying to come up with a renewable way of doing this. And I need to test how long it takes these piglins to trade so I can make an automatic piglin trading system. I like how in my live stream titled Sauron's Toes, I'm not even gonna really touch Sauron for like the first hour of it. Right. Hear me out, alright. So what are we gonna try to do tonight? Like with Sauron? Well, um, if you finish enchanting Owl, then we can. But uh, I was gonna say like, do the, do like the base, like the kind of Blackstone Mountain leading up to him. Ooh. I like that idea. That's why I call it Sauron's toes. Because I have a <laughs> I have a plan for him. A four step plan. Nice. You're gonna make his base or something like that? I call it the reverse head, shoulders, knees, and toes plan. Oh my god, that's very descriptive. Where we make his toes and then, and then we detail his or sorry, I so it's like it's, I call it the reverse head, shoulders, knees, and toes, and then you add the eyes, ears, mouth, and nose. So basically we make his toes, the base, and then we make the basic um, knees, the basic um, shoulders, and the basic head. And then after we go in in detail from the top down, and eyes, ears, mouth, and nose. Okay, here's the plan. I already have it done, so I gotta cover this up and not spoil it, even though it's probably in the thumbnail, but whatever. Um, we gotta have the feet first, we're gonna build the bottom, then we're gonna add the knees, then the shoulders, and then the head for the episode. That's it. Simple. Simple as that. That's all I gotta do. But, uh, then I did a live stream, and I actually found this really new, cool way of, uh, mining netherite, so, uh, check this shit out. And then this is my favorite part. You see, all I gotta do... Just take one of these in my hand, have a backup, and I just drink this. I now have fire resistance for eight straight minutes, and I fucking dive into the deep. If there's any, any ancient debris like over here, it should stand out like a sore thumb because it's bright blue. if I can get a stack of ancient debris doing this. My elytra is getting pretty low. No, this is not for Jackson. Jackson already got it. I'm just testing the efficiency of this because I want to see how much I can get in one hour. Like, my half ass TNT explosion got me about 40 in one hour's time. And so far, I'm at 16 minutes and got 33. So, this is obviously way more efficient.
Also, hear me out. We all do this as a server. Krusty Craft Season 2 finale eventually. Netherite Beacon. Like, come on. If we all did this, this is a faster method than any other method ever uh, conceived. After getting about two stacks of ancient debris in just in slightly under an hour's time, um, I bet I could have gotten more if I was really. I bet I could have gotten to two and a half if I was really, really gunning for it. But um, Jackson had finally maxed out his armor, and now we were gonna start building the uh, Eye of Sauron tower. It's just you know he had full netherite, and I have a max mace. I figured I would just test how much damage it can do with one wind burst charge on a max set of netherite armor and uh this is how it went i missed you took half a heart i did oh one heart that time one heart well it's because you didn't have your saturation i like where you chose to put the pants or the white thank you Thank you, thank you, thank you. No. Stay still. Oh, dude, that took one and a half. One and a half. Dude, wow. I don't want to die. I don't want to die with all my... Stop, please. <laughs> I hate you. I hate you. Where's my stuff? That's a great question. Yeah. Where, where is your stuff? Gavin, I swear to God, the mace... Fucking obliterates my stuff. Uh, chat, can we get a hand? Well, it, it didn't obliterate your stuff the last seven times, did it? No. Did it just send it sky high? I swear to God, if, it, if we can't find myself, you're doing everything again. You're on your own time. I just restored an old world backup. That is not supposed to happen. The mace does, in fact, not squash items. I have no idea what happened there. Really weird, though. I terraform all this dirt real quick. It's gotta go. This is so nice with our shovels. I know. This is so, like, satisfactory. Just giving it all this instantly. Okay. How tall are we gonna make this thing, by the way? Fucking tall. 197 blocks tall, to be exact. Um, this next bit is probably just gonna be a compilation of each part of the build, the head, shoulders, knees, and toes that we are making with cuts in between of the stuff that we did in the between these two days of building this gigantic ass fucking tower, because it took a lot. My old gold trading method was unarguably dog shit. So, um, I made this new design with four more picklins, and I believe this should be working. So, I got a stack of gold blocks. If I just throw this in here, it's not gonna empty for some reason. But if I flip this lever, This should be a way more efficient way to trade for this stuff. 
But now what I got to do is build a gold farm. I'm going to stand here. And we're going to progressively take snapshots of the farm until it's done. So, uh, first stage. That's the collection chamber done. Drop down chamber and platform outline have been constructed. I'm now halfway done with the layers of this thing. Alright, all the layers have been built. Now time for the trapdoors in the middle bit. It's a good gold farm. Basically all you do, if you get here, is you fly up to that little box and you just sit in it. Like if I just fly up here and then I dip back down, I'm 90% sure we'll see a bunch of piglins just killing themselves. Yep. This is so beautiful. So much so because I didn't feel like breaking all this bedrock, I created an auto dropper system back into a crafter. God, I fucking love crafters so much to get it into ingots. Look at that, I just emptied this into there and I'm already at 32 ingots again. This is beautiful. All right, so the way this works is I have these brewing stands here for a reason because this strategy is freaking impact. Holy shit. Oh, soul speed three. Beautiful. I'll have to come back. Actually, I'll take that for later. No, that's two. That's two. Whoopsie. Yoink. Hey, see all this? Ignore that it's blue. I have a texture pack to make netherite uh, easier to see. Hey, Bart. I'm about to show uh, our buddy Aiden here how a real man mines for netherite. <laughs> Holy shit! Holy shit! I have been busy in between episodes. <laughs> Holy, why do you make it so big? That's what she said. Anyway, um, so yeah, this this thing is... Okay, so is this only for gold? Uh, yeah, and rotten flesh. So all the gold will end up in this chest. And then all the rotten, except for one nugget apparently. Um, all the, uh... All the, um, what's it called? All the uh, rotten flesh and swords and extra stuff is going to end up in these chests. And so, Jackson, what I want you to do when you, a a if you AFK this, is take the gold from this chest. Uh-huh. So right now I have a stack and a half just from sitting there right there. This is a stack and a half of gold just from sitting there. Normally this will probably be off. Just that lever turns it on and off. You put the gold in this chest. And you flip the lever. Oh, it automatically does it? That's sick. Yeah, I've already done it a couple times as you can see. Feel free to take a soul speed 3 buck. Oh, we've got soul speed B. Uh, those are two, two, one. Here, I found a third. Here, I found a three. There you go. Okay, okay, okay. Now we have a sufficient and renewable source of blackstone. Let's get this video back on track. No more netherite mining. I got a ton of it already for now. All right, let's get this back on track. Sauron's got to get done.
we have now finished the head, shoulders, knees, and toes, but the head is missing one very important thing, but I mean, come on, look how cool this fucking thing looks, you could damn well know what it's missing though, and that is what we're about to see next. I haven't looked at it for far, I'm, on, I'm right here, I'm on top of the thing. What are we looking at? And we're gonna look at the eye on the count of three. Ready? Yep. One, two, three. Oh, there's a fucking cloud in the way. I'm moving to a different point. And there it is. Damn, I'm so proud of this thing. It needs more detail in the future, but for the first outline, this this is really good. Sick. Oh my god, looks so cool. Dude, that actually looks so good. I even added an extra detail if you fly up to it. It, the fire still hurts. It's not friendly. <laughs> it's it ain't too hard. That's awesome. Oh, it looks so good. Holy shit. That's going to do it for today's episode, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. I spent way too much of my life in my late nights. It's currently 4 a.m., so suck my dick. Um, peace. Too long, man.